Hey, hello everyone. I'm back again. It's dinner time. So, um, these are the items that would have been in the video, like trail mix. But, uh, of course, the date, as you can see, run out. So, I don't think it's like a good thing to eat those. Of course, OT biscuits as well, British rations. Too much sugar, can't have them. Tutti Frutti, British rations. Too much sugar, can't do that. Peanut butter, can't do that either. And of course the tropical uh, punch beverage powder, can't do that either. So they're all the items that were missing from this ration pack. So all I'm basically left with is a soup, a peach bar and a beverage powder, sugar free. So that's it, that's the way it goes. And I have been busy making uh, K-Russian crackers out of French biscuits. I think it's pretty uh, about as near as you'll get. So I'm busy working away on those. Um, so right then, uh, let's get the uh, pan going and get dinner on the go, get the drinks out and stuff. I also just discovered that I have another Sybil homemade pack uh, that was buried. I didn't see it. So there's two more Sybil ration packs to come. So I'll have to do... Military ration, civil ration, military ration, civil ration, and then whatever else after that. Um, that's the way it's going to be, because I've still got the packs to get through. <laughs> I only thought I did two, but it turns out I actually did three. But never mind. So let's get the beverage powder out, which is beverage-based cranberry grape. Which I'm not sure <laughs> is going to be that nice, to be honest. Not sure, but time will tell, I guess. I can smell it here. I can smell it already. Look at that. Sugar free, this one, or so it says. <laughs> so it says. Mm, quick stir around. God knows what the hell that's going to taste like. It's like a black currant look about it. That's what it looks like. It's like a black currant. Got that kind of black currant look. Mm, smells uh, interesting. That's all I can say. <laughs> right, let's get peach and fruit date and day and peach fruit bar even. Pea for peach. Pea for peach. I've had these many times, they're really nice. Yeah, smells very nice, as per usual. Right then, as we know, have no extras. Um, let's have a taste of this drink, and I'm waiting for the soup to boil. Yeah. Well, surprisingly, that's actually quite nice. I thought that would be... Uh, totally disgusting because as you know that grape um, which I have a pack of I think um, it's not that nice it's like artificial that's actually a hell of a lot better than the grape even though it's got grape in it but um, you know what can you do <laughs> um, I reckon this trail mix might be alright it was actually in the bag, so I'll just pour them out there. I've got to go anyway. I've got to go. So I have been munching on these, but of course, the pack date ran out. I'm not sure how long nuts keep for. So, little good selection there. Mmm. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Very nice, yeah. Loads of seeds there, look at that, loads of seeds. Don't know what type of seeds these are, I have no idea. Dried fruit, but them seeds, I have no idea. Hmm. Well, yeah, alright. I should have checked the date on the pack, really. Hmm. 
And all right, yeah, not bad, not bad. Yeah, let's try um, spooning some instead. You can see some dried fruit there. I have no idea what that was. He's dropped it. I have no idea what that was. A few of them just escaped. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, not bad. I tell you what the ingredients are on the pack, but the writing's so small I can't actually make it out. I cannot make it out. Just a bit too small for me. Yeah, can't really make it out. But I saw some of this uh, grape cranberry drink, uh, cranberry juice drink thing. Mm. Oh, yeah, not bad. Very rich in colour that. Cranberry and grape, highly recommended. If you see that, have it, it's, it's nice. Like a good mix of the two together. I didn't, I, you know, I'm, I'm really sure they weren't gonna go well, but they have gone together beautifully. I'm quite impressed with that. And I'll gladly have that again, but of course I won't be getting any more packs. So it's not gonna happen. <laughs> right, I'm gonna pause the video and uh, check the suit. Right, the soup is ready. And so, yeah. at the top, or at the bottom. Will it rip? Yes, it does. That's uh, extremely hot. Very hot. Right. Right, there we go then. Some pepper. Oh, no chicken soup without pepper. No, no. Right, let's see if this soup's any cop then. Let's see, shall we? Bit of a mix round. Black pepper in there. Yeah, that's a better soup consistency. It smells nice. But uh, I think that could be a little bit too hot. <laughs> Time will tell. Right then, here we, here we go then. Chicken and veg soup. Ow. <laughs> All right, okay. Well, yeah. yeah, it's nice, yeah. Taste of chicken and a lot of vegetables in there. A lot of like carrot and God knows what else. It's not as bits of chicken. Maybe potatoes and onions possibly. But that is nice. Yeah. Yeah. That was a very nice soup. I like it. Nice bits of chunky chicken. A load of vegetables. Probably peas, maybe, and I just have no idea. <laughs> Where's the, uh, well, it's in the kitchen. But yeah, so. Yeah, yeah nice bits of chicken. Nice uh, chunky vegetables. That was very nice for a change. Out of all the soups I've had, that has to be the nicest. I'll gladly finish that up. Yeah, vegetables are lovely. Done that for six minutes. If it, if it had the soup, chicken and veg soup, do it for six minutes in a boiling pan. Or if you had a big rush in the heater which folds over. Uh, you could put it in there for uh, seven minutes or so. But that is a very nice chicken soup. Chicken and veg soup. Mmm. Yeah, black pepper went very well with that. Very well. That is nice. Very, very nice. Hmm. Well, yeah. very nice that. I like it. Right then, I will finish this up. And um, we'll be back.
I'll try and do a close up first. A bit of a close up of the soup there. See those vegetables, look at carrots and peas maybe. Or um, runner beans possibly. Loads of herbs, but that's, that's really, really nice. I like it. Yeah, that was really nice. I really enjoyed that. Beautiful. Best soup ever. Even as good as one of our uh, tin suits we get in supermarkets. That was very, very nice. All right, so that's more of this cranberry grape. Which is lovely. Very surprised. Beautiful. Right, I'll check the sugar in there, so it's pretty low. So, it's, it's, it's doable. Yeah, very nice, that. Firm, soft, and good for you, too. Very good for you. Same, um, with no more contents, really, because it's all high in sugar. Such a shame. Such a shame. But uh, that was very nice. Mm. Yeah. Well, it's not too bad. No, uh, you know, nut, if, you had, if I was born up to date nut selection, you know, I would have had a trail mix or nut and raisin mix or something like that. But um, I forgot to check the sell by dates. It's gone past, way past, but I don't know. Tastes all right to me. Tastes perfectly fine. Well, so there you go. That's the dinner time over with. Um, so chicken soup was fantastic. The added trail mix was, it was all right. You know, got dried fruit and loads of different nuts and raisins and stuff like that. It's just nice. Uh, cranberry grape was just very nice, sugar free, very, very nice. I'll gladly have that again, but of course I won't. <laughs> or will I? Yeah, very nice. And Dayton Peach Bar, um, sorry, Dayton, uh, what was it again? Yeah, Dayton Peach, yes, I was right. Dayton Peach Bar, very, very nice. Very firm, very soft. Um, had loads of vitamins and stuff like that. So it was quite good for you. And I would have those every time. I've had quite a few of those. But that is it for today. And tomorrow we'll be back with a uh, tea time menu. With uh, tomato pasta salad and um, hot drink. And um, loads of other bits and pieces. We'll uh, come back and uh, have that tomorrow after my physiotherapy hydrotherapy appointment tomorrow. I mean, because I will be quite tired, <laughs> very tired when I get out of that pool. Right, so thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for liking all my other videos. Thanks for watching my other video on Monday. Uh, thanks for all the likes and comments and stuff like that. You're an awesome, bunch of guys and girls. Seriously, I like all of you. You're awesome. Trust me, awesome. But I'll be back after uh, my hospital appointment tomorrow and we'll uh, finish the last uh, section of the video. So cheers for watching, have a great day and uh, bye for now.